I once had to break into my own flat halfway through a haircut. <laughs> David. Oh, interesting. <laughs> so, uh, what, what, tell us the scenario. I was having a haircut. Where were you having a haircut? Uh, on, my door, on the doorstep of my flat. Now, that's an unusual location to you have know a haircut. Why? You know why? Because he did not want to clean the hair that was on the floor in the flat, so it's outside, so just to push it... Yeah, in I the, can understand why you might... The more work you can do why for me, Fred, the more... Uh, thank you very much. Yes, that's why. <laughs> why weren't you in a hairdresser's or barber shop? Do you want to take this one, Fred? <laughs> <laughs> Appreciate that. Uh, didn't have much money at the time, and my flatmate was pretty sure that she could cut my hair. She was pretty confident. But okay. why the outside? Because... Uh, if you do it inside, you've got to sweep up all the hair. <laughs> <laughs> it's too messy. We thought if we did it outside, we wouldn't have but to do it. But was there a plug? Huh? Was there a plug outside? Was it clippers, scissors? Oh, it was uh, just scissors. That's all we had. So it was scissors. an acoustic, <laughs> as it were. Yeah, it was an, an acoustic haircut, yeah. Yeah, unplugged session. And... <laughs> what was the haircut? Well, it was meant to be something close to this, but um, as it got interrupted halfway through, so it ended up that it was short at the front, short at the back, and kind of like that at the side, like <laughs> quite long. Like someone took a mullet and went like that. Yeah. <laughs> so what? she wasn't trained as a hairdresser? In no way, shape or form. And you did not mind that she was going to cut your hair? It was an adventure. <laughs> were you I? Was I? Hi? No, we were <laughs> on the bottom of the flat. Oh, we yeah. were... <laughs> <laughs> I love that. Well, thank you, Lee. Thank you very much. They don't, they don't respect this kind of stuff, but I love yeah, that. Yeah. Now, you said that you were interrupted. What, what was the interruption? Oh, well, we realised that we'd locked ourselves out the flat because uh, we, a cat wanted to get in the front door, asked each other, you got your keys? Ah. Mm. Neither what? of us had brought our keys out. Was it your cat? No, it wasn't our cat. It was just a cat wanted to get in the door and we weren't going to be like, who are you, who are you visiting? <laughs> So th this is not the door to your flat. <laughs> this is the door to the block of flats. Yeah, we were right? outside, like outside, outside. So which yeah. floor did you leave in? Uh, I think we're the third floor. So how did you get up there? We asked some builders for a ladder. <laughs> I asked them first and they said no. And then my friend asked them and they said yes. And at the time, I was all like, oh, I was a bit stupid. And I was like, oh, they're just letting you because you're a girl. And then she pointed out, you've got half a haircut and no shoes on. <laughs> Did you consider, when you notice you've been locked out, yes. did you consider finishing the haircut before trying to get back in? I had to be in central London uh, quite soon for a gig. And right. my wallet and everything was in the flat. I right. wouldn't be able to travel there, so I needed to act now. So I couldn't finish the haircut. Luckily, I'm a comic and I'm allowed to look silly. <laughs> All right, what are you thinking? I don't think so. Why would you get somebody to cut your hair with scissors? I mean, if it was clippers and you had a haircut like me, I'd understand, but with scissors... I mean, it's got to be a lie. But I mean, my team think it's a lie. I can see why they think it's a lie. You're and happy so to go I'm with lie. I'm happy to go with lie. OK. James, were you telling the truth or was it a lie? Uh, I was telling the truth. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. James did break into his own flat halfway through a haircut, and we have a picture of the haircut. Oh, my God. 